Okay guys, so currently my hair is completely washed, no product or anything like that. I do have a microfiber towel, I'll show you guys how it looks. It's the bomb.com, so if you need one, just buy it from the dollar, uh, like dollar store. My hair is not completely wet, just a little damp. So that's what you want your hair to look like. The product I'm going to start off with is the Garnier conditioner, and I'm going to go ahead and use like one or two pump just so that I can detangle my hair. That's how much I'm using. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and just brush my hair with a dental brush. Now it's completely detangled, so now I'm gonna put the leave-in conditioner. And I use another Garnier leave-in conditioner, and this product smells so good, and I've been with this for how long now? For years. So next, I'm going to go ahead and part my hair in three sections, plus a little mini one just for the front because the front of my hair is a little bit shorter than the rest of my hair, just for styling purposes. So the next product I'm going to start with is the Shea Moisture Leave-In Conditioner. Just go back, 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 back. And make sure you put it all through your hair. The next product I'm going to use is the Eco Style Alcohol Free. Because this is the Max Hold Crystal. That's the name of it. I don't know if you guys ever seen this, but I started to try this new one out and I actually really like it. I'm going to go ahead and put the gel on my hair now. This is the mop that you're using. The next thing we're going to do is brush out the dental brush. So now I'm going to focus in the front and do the same process again. Shea Moisture, and then I'm going to add gel. In the front of my hair, I'm going to finger curl a little bit. about the white stuff that you guys see that's the shea moisture but majority of the time it like goes away when your hair dries up so I'm gonna go ahead and get my edges now gel and toothbrush sometimes guys if you feel like you put too much of the product especially like the white stuff you can use the microfiber towel to get rid of it Okay guys, so I'm gonna let my hair air dry for a little bit and show you guys after. 
Okay guys, so it's been about two hours since I left my hair air dry and this is how it's looking right now. Like, it looks so much cooler, it looks really curly, and it, it's such, like, this looks awesome to me. This is my first time actually leaving my hair curly and fully out, and I'm loving it. Whenever you use Shea Moisture, your hair is so bouncy. So after a couple of hours, most likely my hair will even be more bouncier, more shinier. Because every single time I use Shea Moisture, that's the results my hair ends up being. But this is the end look. As always, don't forget to hit that like button, don't forget to subscribe, and if you have any questions, please leave it in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys later.